Hello, my name is Jackson Yagel, and our journey first begins in Finley Hall, room 216. It was around this time I was driving around during Hurricane Isais, and I realized that above all else, we were at the mercy of the weather. From hurricanes, tropical depressions, cyclones, and derechos, there's little we can do to mitigate their effects. This was more or less the idea behind my thesis. There has to be a way to lessen, if not outright stop, the effects of these storms. So I got to work, breaking down tropical storms to see what avenues I could take. Of many things I sought to redesign, the unsuspecting storm drain is what became my area of focus. I realized early on that only so much could be accomplished through sketching, so I employed the use of my school's laser cutter to cut out varying drain grate patterns and test them in a rain simulation box that I designed. After seeing my models, I saw an opportunity to design my drain in a modular fashion. This would not only allow easier access for DPW workers as they service the drains, but it would provide the ability to upgrade or modify these drains based on geographical or topological locations. This, however, did not solve the root problem that all storm drains face. They get clogged. Like, a lot. And in order to combat this, I decided to have my storm drain be both the sword and the shield during a tropical storm or flood. I accomplished this by designing a small hydroelectric generator for the bottom of my drain. This allows my design to power a small pump which routes some of the water up to the street to clear off the drain in the event of a blockage. This system is aided by a subgrate which is designed to mimic the motion of a whirlpool, accelerating the water towards the generator, which in turn generates more power. Now without further ado, I present to you Torrent, the smart storm drain. And as we come to a close, I would just like to thank each and every one of you for being a part of this Senior Design Showcase. Thanks.